Hello everyone and welcome to the MathDBase.com Anacast series. I'm your host, John Kishidu. In this installment in the Development of Mathematics series, I'm going to discuss the decimal system, part 3, relationships between decimals and fractions. Recurring or repeating decimals are decimal numbers in which a single digit or group of digits repeats indefinitely. A pure recurring decimal is a recurring decimal in which all of the digits after the decimal point repeat. In a mixed recurring decimal, the decimal point is followed by one or more digits that do not repeat. A bar above a digit or group of digits indicates that portion of the decimal that repeats. For example, one-third is a pure recurring decimal. The digit 3 repeats indefinitely. One-seventh is also a pure recurring decimal, but in this case, a group of six digits, 142857, repeats indefinitely. One-sixth is a mixed recurring decimal. The decimal point is followed by a 1, then the digit 6 repeats indefinitely. Terminating or finite decimals are decimal numbers with a finite number of digits. In other words, after a certain number of digits, they stop. For example, 617 divided by 50 equals 12.340000. Since the zeros do not affect the value of the number, they can be left off. Any fraction can be expressed as either a recurring or a terminating decimal. For example, the fraction 3 over 50 is equivalent to the fraction 6 over 100, which is the same as 0 0.06, a terminating decimal. Also, with 700 over 33, we can divide 700 by 33 to get 21.212121 continuing, which is a recurring decimal. To write a pure recurring decimal as a fraction, Construct a fraction that has the repeating digit or group in the numerator and one nine for each decimal place of the repeating group in the denominator. In the repeating decimal 0 0.090909 continuing, the repeating group has two digits, 0, 09. So the fraction will have those two digits in the numerator and two nines in the denominator. That fraction reduces to 1 over 11. Similarly, 0 0.123, 0.123, 0.123 continuing, has a three-digit repeating group. So we would write a fraction with 1, 2, 3 in the numerator and three nines in the denominator. That fraction reduces to 41 over 333. To write a mixed recurring decimal as a fraction, construct a fraction in which the numerator is the difference between all of the representative digits and the non-repeating digits and the denominator has as many nines as there are repeating digits, followed by as many zeros as non-repeating digits. For example, in the mixed recurring decimal 0 0.1090909, there is one non-repeating digit, the 1, and the two-digit repeating group 09. The numerator will be 109 minus 1, and the denominator will be 990. One nine for each repeating digit, and the zero for the one non-repeating digit. The result is 109 minus 1 over 990, or 108 over 990, which reduces to 6 over 55. In 0 0.358678678678 continuous, there is a non-repeating pair of digits, 3, 5, and a repeating group of three digits, 8, 6, 7. The numerator of the fraction will be 35867 minus 35, and the denominator will be 99900. After reducing, the fraction becomes 2986 over 8325. 